from uh, two or three years i have been seeing that uh, our seniors got uh, like uh, they did projects in eyic and uh, they reached to the finals also they got patented uh, so uh, it motivates me a lot because i have seen their hard work and dedication towards their projects so uh, i thought i could be the one like them proper hardware and proper thing should be selected prior to the going to any uh, decisions suppose like we have a voltage regulator of 5 volt it's not necessary that it will give 5 volt itself and sometimes things burn up things burst there's, there's just too many surprises and uh, we got to learn like like uh, in cases of iot like the limitless the applications that we had like or the possible changes that we could make uh, if you have planned to uh, buy any particular sensor or anything any uh, technical thing or any hardware thing so do not uh, take it granted for it it will work for you means uh, you first go through its data sheet first go through its uh, means the hardware uh, should should it will be work properly on your circuit and then uh, go and buy it Uh, it will save your money while testing yeah like not everything will work at a given point like it will work in the room but will it will not work uh, like at the like at the, uh, where it is supposed to be working so yeah that's something <laughs> never trust on the jumper wire uh, that is the main <laughs> that is the main point <laughs> when we are ready with our circuit and uh, all, all things are sorted but uh, you are not getting the output and you are wasting your whole day on the particular uh, that problem and uh, at the ending of the day you came to know, know that uh, the problem is lying lying with that particular jumper not lying with your circuit or the code uh, that is a major point means you should check always check the continuity uh, means with the multimeter that thing uh, before uh, means before uh, you can say the executing the code or, or anything else with the hardware we should be always prepared to fail like it's not necessary that what we intend to do or plan to do will always work out in the end so it's always like you should always be uh, like uh, bracing for impact as some call it your things your plans whatever your hardware or software might fail and you have to think of other stuff so it's always uh, important to be prepared and that's something we really worked on it's like that uh... eureka moment for us so because uh, if our product got developed and placed uh, at the spot so like we will be seeing it and we will uh, feel very happy that yeah we made it while going through the competition these students uh, started like a project like this idea as a project but uh, as they were moving ahead uh, through the competition they started thinking that project or that system as a product and they were like how this community will require or uh, they started thinking about the issues which they may uh, which this product may face when it will be installed so uh, that aspect of uh, education they have developed through the competition we can say they started thinking about the uh, like 360 degree angle of all this uh, stuff so what i mean is technical aspect then market aspect and then reliability so uh, views of the customer or the views of the a uh, stakeholders so they started uh, putting all this thing into a single box and then they started developing the system uh, at the end it is very like what we can say happy thing that or happy moment for us that we are able to build up product what we thought of 